Can you shout favor? Can you shout favor? There was a woman in the Bible by the name Mary. Mary was born in the land of prostitution. Mary's family was not such rich family. Mary's area was the land full of drunkards. And no one could expect anything good to be born from that land. But now there was an angel of God who came by the name Gabriel. When angel Gabriel came to Mary, he said, Greeting to you whom God has hired a favor. It means to be hired a favor. You were not qualified for that position. You were not designed to be on such position. But when favor has located you the protocol is suspended it doesn't matter where you are coming from it doesn't matter what your parents are having it doesn't matter what type of the color of your body it is you might be black but when favor has come on you you are qualified to become a rich man when your favor has come on you, whether you are coming from the poor marriage, the same would happen to the woman by the name Esther. Esther meet with the favor of the Lord and he was qualified to be I talk to someone right now. I prophesy favor in your life. I prophesy favor in your finances. I prophesy favor in your marriage. I prophesy favor wherever you go. Listen to me. God does not qualify people who are already qualified. God does not qualify people who can deceive. Bible says God shoots the fools of this world and give them wisdom so that they can put to shame those who think they are knowledge in this world. I prophesy to you, if you are in poverty, favor will qualify you. When favor locate, you don't fight alone. When favor locate, God will be at your side. I speak somebody right now. You might be that you are not qualified for that position. You might be that you are not qualified for that marriage. You might be that you are not qualified for that office. You might be that you are not qualified for that promotion. But favor today, I said, but favor of the Lord Almighty is coming for you. Do you know sometimes when favor has located you, even the way you pray, you won't have to change. Even you can to tune other tongues that are not even available in the limbs of the spirit. But you enter into China and you begin to speak in tongues like Chan Tung, Chan Tung, Chin Chia, Hum Shalamande, Vrekina Masko Frahadia, Raka Taka Suva, Raka Yabaya, Reteke Sina Mrahado, Reina Spu Shalamandra Kedia Masuva, Raka Tu Yerkenia Masuva, Raido Kaskalamia, Suske Remaha. Can I hear you shout favor? My name is Prophet Gift the Solid One. I bless you with faith. It is done. Shalom! Abuye Akudari Seni in and in a prophet gift by Don Dr. Solid One. Leloso Mwapa Dadera and Gulandire and Ipano Pam Zat TV. Monga Manta is on Saturday in a young Sendima Candy Pam. Dimafuna Mwapa Dadera and Guita Nendi Kumambo Wama Pimpiro Ome Dima Clanao Mawa Sunday. Paka Babua Secondary School. Kuyambira 8 o'clock Mamawa. Paka na 5 o'clock Matulo. Tikuita nini nonsi sekundi muka pezi kumene yiku ndipo mwe wanu su kala chibwati mwati. Abale ndi alo. Lero, tikulimbi kiseni so ndi malemba. Amene akuchokira pa Exodo chapter 17. Kuyambira verse number 8. Utenga wanga kavana programu yanga. Ima chida uti the prophetic season. Imene ndi makala ndiku yanku laso kuza aneneri. Ndi mulongo. Aneneri. Ndi mulongo. Kode aneneri londula aliku. Kodi mulungu, aku yangu labi, yangu ndi inde, anenilaliko, inde, mulungu aku yangu labi. Exodo chapter 17 verse number 8, diwe nika mupaipu la English. Pamele aku nauti, then came Amalek, the descendants of Esau, to fought with Israel at Lephedem. And Moses said to Joshua, choose for us, out of men, and go out and fight with Amalek, tomorrow, I will stand on top of the hill with the Lord of God in my hand. So Joshua did as Moses said, and they fought with Amalek. And Moses and Hul went up to the hilltop. When Moses held up his hand, Israel prevailed. When he lowered his hand, Amalek prevailed. But Moses' hand were heavy and he grew weary. So other men took the stones and they put under him and he sat on it. Then Amma alone and Hul held up his hand on the other side, one on the other side, so that the hand should stand still until the sun go down. And Joshua mowed down Dishabo Amalek and his people with the sword. And the Lord said to Moses, write down this as a memorial in the book and rehearse in the ear of Joshua. Amen. 
Bible ni kuti kuna linkhondo pakati pa Amalek obadwa mumbadu wa Esau ndi ana Israel ntundo patulika ndipo Amalek atabwera kusali bana ndi ntundu wa patulika wa ana Israel ati ntundu wa ana Israel siku mateka kuti uchienda woka opanda mneneri ndipo taklati kuwenga Bible kuna kuti ati Mose atamwalira ana Israel ana fula kwa Yehova na wazusira Yoshua Yoshua atamwalira ana Israel ana fula kwa Mulungu na watumizira Juda kutanta usakunena kuti mtundu wa ana Israel suma mva kutetezeka ngati ukale opanda prophet chomwecho Bible kuti kuzatiro masiko siriza ndizaika cha usimu wanga pa tupirina rinose kuti anano amuna asanenera anano akaza asanenera akulu asalota matoto nao na masompenya kutanta usakunena kuti mufumo Mulungu Mulungu ana kozera kuna kuti anthu anga kuti akapambane akagonjese safunika kuyenda opanda wina amene azivesera kwa Mulungu tonsife ndi fatu opempera koma swana kuti sitonse amene tili ana Mulungu Inu ndinu ana mulungu ine simwana wa mulungu ndine kapolo wa mulungu so ngati inu mwana wa mulungu ina ndiri kapolo wa mulungu ndikwenda kuti ndikale pakati kati pa ana a mulungu ndi mulungu kuti ngati mulungu afuna kuchita kanthu kwa wana wake atume kapolo inu mnyumba mwanu ngati muli ndo gwira nchito ena ondi anano mukafuna kuchoka shuka simusira mwana wanu ai shuka mumasira ogwira chito mnyumba mwanu kapolo Ndijifuwa chake mulungu sachi takatu kwa wanawake opanda kutuma kapolo ndiye bamba likuti kutamwera Amalek kuti alimbane ndi ana Israel Mose ana Musa Yoshua kuti tenga ana onse pita nao ni kunkhondo koma ina ndi huli ndi aloni tipita kupiri kumeneko ina ndi kakala ndi kupembesi na sakonde mene ndipo bamba likunena mofeka bwino kunena kuti ati Mose atapita papiri aka kwesa manja ake mwamba mneneri kupira aka kwesa manja ake mwamba ati a Israel ama wina nkhondo Mose aka sisa manja a Israel ama lusa nkhondo kutanta usa kunena kuti pamene mneneri akupembezera zokusa manja lako pamalo ena manja lako kusiko limaenda bwino Pama funikira mneneri pa moyo wako pama funikira prophet pa moyo wako amene asikupembezera pa business muri iyo Pama funika prophet amene azipembesera u president. Pama funika president amene azipembesera kuchita mene kugwira. It means there must be a prophet to intercede for you. There must be a prophet to lies for you. There must be a prophet whom when he raises his hand you wanna conquer your enemies. Ndipo Bible kuna kuti ati manja Amos anatopa. Manja Amos atatopa ati Israel anaamba kulusa nkhondo. Ndipo sinatengera alo ndi huli kuti ngakali yu anali ndi manja kuma manja usana wa kwese tifo manja usana sozedwe ai ndi magadi sefota anali kwa anthu atatu kupiri akananda kuti mose watopa hapa no huli kwesa manja ako ati manja onseo mwana lime kusosa kwa mulungu it means pama kalamu tu mose amene mulungu wa musosa manja ake pama kalamu tu mose amene wa musanka mnyengo yake kuti iyi kayo akagwada kupempera business yako isienda bwi Amai ndi kuse ni kuti mapempera masala kudi ya kuma mpaka pano Palibe chimene chiku sinta Chifukwa kuyankido kama yanko siku na pasunde mmanja mwani Inu muka pempa mulungu ama mfa kuma kuti achite ama funama nenelote abutume Difaki mwona kuna kuti atipamu ya kuna kuti mulungu sachi takantuia Kufikira ata ula chisisha ke mwani ni yake ama sfirives number seven Deni mafuna ndi kuya kuna kuna kuti zima suwe kena kuti muziwe Kuti mafunika lifike siku ni tawi Imene prophet must lies on your behalf Tika waringa Hosea chapter 10 verse number 12 di 13. Ati ndine neri a Israel anama sulidwa. Ndine neri a Israel anasungika. It means mulungu kuti amasule tundu wa Israel. Ama saka saka prophet to use. The situation you are going through there must be a prophet to be used. Di mafuna ndi ya kule nwa mai. Kuti siku ni mulungu wakuta ya ni ai. Kuma kuti mmanikine nyengo ni ntawi. Imene mukumane ndi prophet of God. Amene haka zusa manja ake. Mamira kosi achitika. Haka zusa manja ake. Zazikulu si chitika. Haka zusa manja ake. Manja ni pesega. Haka zusa manja ake. Gongole si prasuka. Di mafuna ni pempenina nuposa jina pompa. Kuma nafuna ni kulimbi kisengu na kuti. You need a man of God. You need a prophet. Who shall lace his hand. 
for you to defeat your enemy. Dia musungu noti neneri sima fika tuote ama zatopa. Akatopa neneri. Chima suwekira a Christ wa sindikira. Amene sarola prophet wa ukute atope. Koma amu gwira mancha kuti prophet ayimilirebe. Amu gwira mancha kuti prophet asasua chakudia. Amu gwira mancha kuti prophet asagone nijala. For akagona nijala prophet yo. Baza nani soko ni gelasu. He needed to kneel down every day. Malamulo abaye bloko chukana kalikari. Ma prophet sama kalapa nyumba. Ma prophet ama gona mchire kumape mbezera. Ma prophet ama gona makajis kumape mbezera. Ma sikuwa na ma prophet ama ma business. Sifuati kulime antu. Amene aku ima ni ma prophet. Ni mafuna ni ya kulema wa omaliza awa. Kwa di muma siwa. Kuti 90% ya tu oleme na msiku lapansi. Ambili mwe ondi ya silamu. 90% ya tu ole meira musiku lapansi. Ambili mwa yondi ya stila. Chifachani. Bible yu yonkula pa 2 mbili chapter 20 verse number 20. Kuti kulubi nilani mulungu. Ndipo musika kasikika. Dari nilani anene. Ndipo musale meira. Asilamu. Ama le mekeza ma prophet a. Kuli la mulolo kasikika lo zwika ntisiko lonsi. Lo tuka ngu yonkula zusra ndi Muhammad. Yuwa uli mafutu. Kwa mataona na kristu wa zanga. Ndi masiku angati, ndi maminisi angati. Amene prophet wachi kristu waka ngoima. Tose tima mnyoza. Siti pere kwa ulimukuma prophet yatu. Ndi faka kristu wa sauka. A kristu wa senda amena lopen pesa. A kristu wa senda amena lopfutika. Kwa maslam, zao shima enda buinu. Fajani, ama le mekeza mneneli wa. Ama le mekeza mhabutu. Ndi surrender all to you.